don't always have to be a gardener, right? You know, you need all sorts of skills to make a community garden or a pr program like yours work. So did the gardeners turn out to help with this? Did you find your people? I mean, you, you know? So we have been pleasantly surprised that from day one, when we brought on our vets and we work with their case managers, we have seen a change in them. It's amazing. And I just, I joke that I stumbled into this, but we also have an indoor hydroponic farm um, along our route that we clean. And so we grow produce for the bars and restaurants. So the people working in there, they get their food handlers card. That's why the bars and restaurants are excited to hire them. They've gotten all that training to be safe around the produce that they're growing because it is a uh, commercial grade food that we're selling to the bars and restaurants. So we sell that then to offset the cost of that staffing as well. That's amazing. We're using our data tracking system, which is our homeless management information system that the feds require, but that's, I joke that we're just using bean counters. So we have our, our produce software, which is great. It tracks it from seed, seed to harvest. And then we have our homeless software that just tracks our encounters and we put in our case notes. But what isn't being tracked is whenever we put in these gardens and this programming is that the overall neighborhood improves. Thank you.